Hey there guys, so you are going to end up creating something that looks like what's in front of you on this screen today. So what you're going to do is you have just finished watching the video where you have filled this out. Now remember if um, it's the bold question like number three here, you actually had to answer the questions and um, you are going to make sure that you have checked your answers to make sure that they are correct. Um, and then what you're going to do, you get down to here. So using all of that information above, I want you guys to create a mind map or a concept map that shows all of these interactions. Um, so when I made this, or when I made all the copies, this was supposed to be in the packet. However, it, for whatever reason, is not. So it is on the Google Doc that you clicked on to get to this video. Um, anyway, so that's there for you, but the good news is, is now on the back of your packet, you have a blank page to put your mind map on. So it actually kind of worked out for the better. So what you're going to do is you're going to, I found this and I thought this was really good to help you to create a mind map. So what you do in the center, you have your central idea. So what is the idea that you're coming up with? I'm going to go ahead and tell you yours is about ecosystems. So that is the word that's going to go in the center. So down here, your central idea or concept is going to be ecosystems. This is very colorful. Um, you can have color. It can be black and white. It's totally up to you. Um, you can add pictures in. So you're going to have branches for key themes. I would suggest that you kind of use the themes that are separated out here for you as your different branches. Um, then you're going to have your keywords and phrases using sub branches. So using all of the information above, I want to see what you come up with for your mind map. Okay. Um, you're going to have connections of where things are connected. So you'll see like right here, um, the important discovery and date. This is a connection back to the main author, or here's another one. Okay. You do need to make it obvious with connections. So here's the problem. If you, you do everything the same color, it is really hard to see where lines cross. Okay. So you'll want to make sure that there's some way to differentiate yours which means tell the difference between yours and someone else's, okay? So there's that. Um, when you finish, go ahead and turn it in. Um, I think that's it, okay? Good luck, have fun.